This tutorial is going to show you how to use your laptop as a second monitor on Windows 10 or 11. We're going to need an HDMI cable and an HDMI to USB adapter, also known as the video capture card. If you don't have them, you will find the links in the description of this video. Most laptops will have HDMI output, but no HDMI input. This is why we need to use an adapter. Okay, plug in your USB adapter into your laptop, plug in one end of your HDMI cable into the adapter and the other end into your desktop computer. Make sure it's connected and go to start button and start typing device manager. Here, go to device manager option. Your USB capture card will be listed under cameras. You'll notice that Windows listed your camera as USB 3.0 capture. And that's because not a camera, but the capture card itself is what supplies the signal and the camera input to your laptop. Your laptop will treat your adapter as a USB camera. That means it can use the signal from your desktop computer in other applications. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you two applications for using your laptop as a second screen. One of those applications is the camera app on the window. So let's go ahead and go to start type camera and click on the first option. Now make sure your video capture card is plugged into your laptop and also plugged into your desktop computer to avoid seeing this error. Once the camera app starts, you'll see something like this. Now, if you still don't see your output on the screen, click on this button here and select it from the dropdown. Now, the only problem with this app is that you can't remove the black borders. For that reason, it is recommended to download and install OBS Studio. It's one of the best tools for working with video on Windows 10 or 11. Once installed, launch the application and go to this plus button over here and select video capture device option. Now here, just click OK and on the next screen, choose your USB device from this drop down over here. Now, right click on the main view and find full screen option. And on this secondary drop down, select your laptop monitor. And that's pretty much how you set up your laptop to be your monitor with HDMI cable. 